Hello. Uh, we've all been through a lot lately. Uh, some not as bad as others and some far worse than others. Uh, but I just wanted to you know, take a second to express my appreciation uh, to every staff member, uh, to every employee, uh, to every community member in the Ailey Independent School District on how they have handled uh, what has been, as we all know, the, the worst uh, hurricane in, uh, in a long time on the Texas coast. One of the things I'm most proud about uh, after the storm hit was how our community, both the school district and the general community at large here at Hayleaf, came together to create a shelter uh, for many evacuees uh, throughout the general region, both here locally and in Fort Bend County. Uh, we did not have support from the Red Cross, from the county, from the city, or from any other government, uh, governmental entity for that matter. It was all done with local volunteers from our school district and from the Aleve community. And, and as I mentioned, I can't tell you how proud I am of how that was, how that was demonstrated and how successful it was. We literally, within the first three hours of announcing we were opening a shelter and that we were seeking volunteers, had over 3,500 people from our general area volunteer. It gives me pride, and it should give you pride. We should all be proud of what we did as a community and as a school district to serve the people that were in need the most at this time. I also want to thank you as an employee uh, for being patient with us and for understanding that uh, when difficult decisions are made, one of the most important things for us to do is to be able to communicate with you. And so we are going to attempt to start school on the 11th. And uh, as you know, by watching this video, we've, uh, you know, we're attempting to bring uh, employees back to give them a chance to figure out transportation routes and carpooling strategies and um, just kind of get their, their bearings about themselves. So uh, in advance, I want to uh, express my appreciation to all of you. I know each one of you have your own story to tell. Some of you d are out of your home right now. Some of you have water in your home right now. Some of you have not been able to go back to your home. Um, and I completely understand that. Uh, we want to bring some normalcy, whatever that is now, uh, to your life as quickly as possible. So don't hesitate to let your Ailey family know what they can do to help. Uh, we will be patient and we will be understanding and we will do everything we can do to help you get through your crisis and your situation. So uh, again, thank you for all that you have done, every single one of you. For those of you that volunteered at the shelter, for those of you that served in leadership roles at the shelter, and for those of you who are attempting to get your life back uh, at home, uh, I, I appreciate everything you've done for this school district.